In the early 19th century, a French mathematician named Urban Le Verrier did something astonishing, he mathematically predicted the existence of a new planet in our solar system, which we now know as Neptune, before anyone had ever seen it. But here's the kicker, his calculations were based solely on the observed irregularities in the orbit of Uranus. This wasn't a fluke or a lucky guess, it was a triumph of deduction over direct observation, a thrilling tale of how the human mind can reach out into the cosmos armed with nothing but mathematics and a telescope. How could someone so distant from these celestial bodies pinpoint a planet that had eluded the eyes of astronomers for centuries? The story begins with a mystery. Uranus, discovered in 1781, wasn't behaving as it should. Its orbit was wobbly, not quite matching the predictions made by Newton's laws of motion. This discrepancy puzzled astronomers, leading to wild theories, from unseen moons to invisible stars. Andrew Le Verrier, who, with a dogged determination and a mind sharp as a tack, hypothesized that the gravitational pull of another, yet unseen, planet was the cause of Uranus's strange behavior. Working with relentless precision, he shared his findings with the Berlin Observatory, where they finally pointed their telescopes and confirmed the existence of Neptune in 1846, almost exactly where Le Verrier had predicted. While Le Verrier's work was a milestone in celestial mechanics, it also sparked debates and rivalries. Simultaneously, British astronomer John Couch Adams had been working on his own calculations, leading to a heated priority dispute that rocked the scientific community. This tale of competitive discovery adds an intriguing human dimension to our narrative, illustrating how the quest for knowledge can drive individuals to extraordinary feats. It also underscores the importance of collaboration and communication in science, as the scientific world grappled with the implications of these independent discoveries. The saga of Neptune's discovery reminds us of the power of observation and deduction. It invites us to marvel at the universe's complexity and our ever-expanding capacity to comprehend it. The story of Neptune isn't just about a planet, it's about the people who dared to imagine what lay beyond the visible, armed with nothing more than pen, paper, and an inquisitive mind. It challenges us to think about the mysteries that still elude us and to consider how, like Le Verrier and Adams, we might one day unravel the unseen forces that shape our universe.